So are you guys going to stand on business and fire Shannon Sharp? Because if you fire Paul Pierce, I'm going to be honest, I think you got to fire Shannon Sharp for this. I think you do. This nigga's out here clapping cheeks on IG Live. Oh my God, ladies and gentlemen, what did I just see on Twitter? Did this man, Shannon Sharp, just cost himself his job on ESPN? Before we get into it, we got to run the intro. I went to the locker room trying to show him love. He, he dissed me. He threw shade at me. I'm like, what the fuck I do? You ready, B? You feel me? Like, if you play, the, he played half the clip. His little minions over here trashing me and shit. I'm like, oh, Look whatever. Me, I'm trying young to B, him. Cruising Last down the west like, side. You, nigga, who the fuck are you? Like, who are you? The O3, Bonnie and Clyde. He's talking about you right now. The locker room. He said all the players are trash. Ladies and gentlemen, did Shannon Sharp just pull a Paul Pierce and make the biggest mistake of his career? I don't even know, man. You know, I got on social media this morning or this afternoon and I see a video of Shannon Sharp on IG Live pretty much clapping cheeks, right? Now, I don't know how this happened. He claims he was hacked. I don't believe he was hacked. I think he just made a mistake and he's trying to cover it up. Now, if you guys remember, a couple years ago, Paul Pierce actually got fired from ESPN for pretty much doing the same thing, even though his wasn't as bad as Shannon Sharp. Paul Pierce was just in the comfort of his own home on his day off, you know, fucking with some stripper hoes. I think one was in the background twerking. But she had on, you know, a thong and, you know, a bra or whatever. And then he had one other stripper giving him like a massage pretty much, right? ESPN fired his ass. Ladies and gentlemen, is this karma for Shannon Sharp? I told you guys in the video that we posted about him a few days ago, I said this on the video. I said this dude is getting a little bit too big headed. He had that viral Cat Williams interview. And then we see him on Nightcap start to talk crazy to his co-host, Ocho Cinco. And I said it on the video, I'm like, yo, this dude is getting a little bit cocky. Is this karma for Shannon Sharp? Ladies and gentlemen, pay attention to how Shannon Sharp was just talking to Ocho Cinco a few days ago about being professional. Let's roll the tapes. Really cool, really cool dude. And um, as soon as he opened the car door and he got out the car door to greet me, the car door locked by accident. The car door locked by accident, so I would have been on time, but the fact that we had to wait for the tow truck and them to bring the Slim Jim was the reason for my delay and getting to the hotel a little late. But I'm here now. I'm here now. Let me ask you a question. So when you go, uh, uh, when you go to ESPN, you go, you take, you have people pick you up from the airport. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, you don't. Uh, when you do inside the NFL, you have people pick you up from the uh, airport. Yeah, at the beginning, yeah. No, you don't. Uh, so I'm just trying to figure out why with your show would you choose to take that route when you don't take that route for ESPN and but inside I the NFL? I wasn't lying. I'm dead, I'm dead serious. When I when uh, I fly into Philly, I have somebody pick me up from Philly. When I fly into New York, I have somebody pick me up from New York. I'm I'm, I'm serious. And my, hold that on. ain't what they told me. I just I just talked about listen to me. Now it's documented, huh? It's documented. <laughs> I, I'm just telling you. But all oh, you I'm have to do is just search my me. tweets. I've been doing it the past 15 years. I always do this. I'm not saying that. Yes, sir. Talk but to o me now. Ocho. Right. Again. Ocho, this right, is part right, of your right, show. Right. Why would you be late? Why would you run the risk of being well, late? I didn't want to be late. I just told you what happened. I would have been on time. But due to unfortunate circumstances of him locking the keys in his car, which I documented, I was just a little late. I went. Why don't you, Ocho, why don't you just why don't you just have the people that you're working for just have them to book like your car service. service? I don't like car service. It's okay. I don't like how them people, they, 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 be, they be mean and they be bougie. I don't like, you know, they be in suits and ties and shit. I, that don't make me comfortable. That don't make me comfortable. What makes me comfortable is like okay. like being able to, to, to sit down and talk. Wait, you want to be comfortable me, or you want to be professional? No, I don't want to be. No, I want to be comfortable. I want to talk to people that I can relate to. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I'm just telling But you but see, I heard the thing, Ocho. You say you want to be professional. You want to do ESPN. You want to do all these professional things. But you want to take a bootleg? No, ride. no, no. I want to. Re I want to remain my authentic self, the same way I always been, and do those things. Is that okay? Okay. No. 
Okay. Let me know how that work out for you. So you guys just heard Shannon Sharp trying to expose his co-host Ocho Cinco about being professional. Now, a few days later, this dude is being more unprofessional than Ocho by clapping cheeks on IG Live. What type of what type of ghetto shit is this? Come on, Unc. We were rooting for you. We were rooting for you, Unc. Now you're clapping cheeks on IG Live. You you pull the most nigga move in 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 YouTube history. Come on. We were rooting for you. You had just you had just taken out Skip Bayless. Now Skip Bayless somewhere laughing at your stupid ass. Now Skip Bayless somewhere laughing at this clown. This nigga, this nigga got caught clapping cheeks on IG Live. Man, I swear, bro, niggas are gonna be niggas, man. Niggas are gonna be niggas. That's just that's just what it is. Niggas are gonna be niggas no matter what. So my question is, ladies and gentlemen, what is ESPN gonna do with Shannon Sharp? Because you fire Paul Pierce for doing something that I would consider not as bad as what Shannon Sharp did. So are you guys gonna stand on business and fire Shannon Sharp? Because if you fire Paul Pierce, I'm gonna be honest, I think you gotta fire Shannon Sharp for this. I think you do. I, I, I can't believe this dude, Shannon Sharp. So ladies and gentlemen, like I said, that's really all I got. Y'all come into the comments, man, and let me know what y'all think about this topic, man. This nigga's out here clapping cheeks on IG Live. I don't even know what else to say. Drop a like on the video, man. Subscribe to the channel. I'm out, man. It's your boy, Reggie. Peace. Wasn't cool to me, they never really liked me Being hated isn't new to me, but uh, I get it Cause when you're winning, they isn't Jealousy has no ending, so pray the Lord Forgive them every day, I gotta thank them for the blessings Rumors about my life, will I ever address them? I don't know, worry about your kicks, my nigga And what are those? <laughs> yeah, we don't know Music nowadays, when y'all gotta be kidding me Lyrics was whack, gave him an A for his energy You tried, my nigga, I would tell you keep it up But the way my shit sounding, I can't see you keeping up I'm the new leader of the new, new niggas There's a lot about you if you ain't fucking with us So go on and ask them who the greatest is And you can keep your two cents if you ain't paying the bills It's real Over, then it's over. I'm glad that we in it. She coming back when she see how I'm living. She played games with a nigga, but now that I'm winning, she doing everything I say with no questions asked. I'm sucking on the titties while I'm grabbing the ass. I used to daydream about her back when I was in class. So you know that when I fucked, I came fast and laughed. I'm doing me now. Bigger rings for the team now. Trying to tie me down fast. Tell her, slow it down. Baby girl wanna sit and play house. So I sat on the couch and put this thing in her mouth. How to flow so north, buddy raised in the south. Got my family tripping cause they can't figure it out. I can't wait no more, man. The time is now. On my mama, I'ma make a prayer. The story is. Where's the first pick? Got the pick in the pick.